Hey guys, so in this video we're going to show you how to perform network-based firmware updates for your GHL device. The steps we'll cover in this video will show you how to update your Wi-Fi module firmware, web server firmware, and web interface through the use of only a web browser. To do this, you'll first need to have access to your device's web interface. If your device is on your network, you can access it by opening up a web browser window and typing in the assigned IP address of your device. You can also access the web interface by connecting directly to your device's built-in hotspot signal. Secondly, you'll need to have the newest firmware files already downloaded either on your Mac computer, Windows computer, smartphone, or tablet. If you don't have these firmware files yet, please go to our GHL Downloads page and download the correct file. You can find the direct link to that page in the description box below. If you're on a PC, please download the newest version of GHL Control Center and install it to your computer. You can find the software in the Related Download section and also in the Software Tools and Drivers section. If you're on a Mac or mobile device, Select the Wi-Fi module ESP update option located in the firmware section. Go ahead and select the option, download it, then unzip the folder. When you unzip the folder, be sure to take note where you are saving it to on your device because you'll need to locate it when you begin the update process. Once you have the necessary files downloaded, you can go ahead and access the web interface of your GHL device. Start by opening up a new web browser window, then typing in the IP address of your device. Once the web interface is finished loading, click on the menu icon. Select Network and wait for the page to load. Click on File Transfer, then select the type of update you want to perform. For the purpose of this video, we're going to update the Wi-Fi module firmware on our Profilux 4 controller. Once you've selected an option, click Next to move on to the next step. Here you are asked to select the specific file. Since we chose to update our Wi-Fi module, we must locate the firmware.bin file. Locate your correct file by clicking on Choose File. If you're doing the update on a PC, you can find the file in the GHL Control Center directory. To get to that folder, simply click This PC, then select your hard drive. Select Program Files x86, find your GCC folder, select the Wi-Fi folder, then select the Wi-Fi Firmware Update Tool folder. The firmware.bin file for updating the Wi-Fi module will be located here. If you are updating the web interface, you can find the necessary file in the web interface folder. If you're updating the web server, you can find that file in the file system folder. For those who are doing the update on a smartphone or tablet, when you are asked to select the necessary file, navigate to the unzipped Wi-Fi module ESP update folder and select the correct firmware file. Once you've found the firmware file, select it then click Next. Click Next again to begin the update. When you see the Update Successful page, click Refresh Page and the update will be complete. Thanks guys for watching this video. If you have any questions about this video or any GHL product, feel free to post on our GHL support forum or send us an email for one-on-one -on -one support. Links and contact info can be found in the description box below. Until next time folks, take care.